This is to prepare and send your images over to DSCL. Um, this may work for other labs, but we're using DSCL for this example. So you go on to DSL website, go right to the bottom, as far as you can go, and select prepare your files. So this gives you all the technical details of what you need to know. So again, scroll right down to the bottom, and here it shows you all the paper sizes with all um, the pixel sizes pertaining to that that size then log on search for mogrify 2 and then you can go down to installing mogrify 2 and basically you come to a page where it shows you how to install on a mac and also how to install on a pc and you need to uh, download uh, Image Magic for a PC. And on that same page, you can download the plugin. Right, we're now into Lightroom in the grid mode, and we clicked Export. And from Export, you want to then click Plugin Manager. And we haven't got it all installed, but if you go down to Add and then find where you've put your plugin we have ours in the main catalog under export folder and so we cancel it because we're already installed and then you can say done and then you can see at the bottom there is the modify 2 and you can expand that with all the details of what it does so at the top we can select what folder it's all going to go into um, so we know where it is then we scroll down and we're going to be altering the image settings so we're going to make this 300 dpi and we're going to leave the what's in there at the moment and then we scroll down now we need to add so we're going to click the um, configuration and if we open it up you can see that uh, on this particular Mac the image magic is already in so then we need to add outer borders so basically we need to add a little white border which is going to be 59 pixels and that's in, in going to be in white so we need to change that from black to white and then we need to uh, add the little black border. So if we add, and then the black border is going to be three uh, pixels. And so it's already black, so that's fine. So we scroll down. And then we scroll down and we want background canvas, which we add in and we have to go back and have a look, find that and you can see the canvas. And so the canvas for this three by two, it's already in there, but you type in from that sheet of the DSCL, 4,800 by 3,800. So, right, so now we're going to, add this to our uh, recipe we're going to give it a, a name so we remember it and it can be used really every time we do it so once it's set so that's set in there and then we're going to export that picture which was a three for two and it opens up and there we double click that to bring that up, show that, and you can see it's now surrounded by a white border and it's got the black key line. So we're going to do the same for the square one. So click on a square one. And we then need to go to that same, we're on that same recipe. And we need to go down and just change the 
uh, long edge um, of, of the square. So change the long edge, 2700 pixels, which is uh, about nine inch, well, which is nine inches. We've got the border and also the black key line. We just need to change the paper size, which is the canvas. And again, you can refer to that section um, in DSL website. And we change that to square and that's our 12 inch square again we're going to save this we're going to give this a name um, so that we uh, can remember it so square with a border 12 by 12 paper size create so that's now saved we're going to export that save for use anytime you go into it and you're going to have a consistent result and there we are the square with a border and a little black border on a canvas. Back onto the DSCL website, click on Order Now, and that will bring up this. And we want standard professional prints, um, which is the cheapest way to go. So now we go down, we're looking for our 3 by 2 which is 16 by 12 choose luster, which we always do now, and then we open up find where the picture is drag it into the box and you obviously you can do multiple pictures this way and start and upload so this will upload and it's going to show you there with the uh, canvas border and so we want to order more we're going to order the uh, Again, standard print, the 12 by 12 paper size. Now we're going to choose Lustre again. And then we're going to find that picture, find the square picture, drag the square picture over into there, upload again. And there we are there's our two pictures and you can obviously have as many pictures in there as you want um, go to checkout and I always choose first class click and drop um, and that does go first class then and that's really all there is to it thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one